Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to go over the Nebula Smart Kit, which consists of a control box and a camera. So I've just got it the other day, and I let's go through and see what's in it. Okay, guys, I will be using a little Nebula camera. So this is what the camera looks like. So I've got this attached to my laptop just as a webcam. So I'm going to use that to um, take all the photos from now on, or the video from now on. Okay, so this is the kit. Inside the kit we get an instruction manual, a control pad. Now, the difference between the Nebula and the um, Sonic um, pad is the Nebula can only have one item attached to it, where the Sonic pad can have four. Okay, so it also comes, of course, with a camera and a little tripod this is one of those flexi tripods you know you can just pull the arms out and it just screws into the bottom which is you can spin the camera just the camera okay you get a USB-C cable that also comes with a G sensor that is used to um, do vibration compensation on your printer so it's good it's all included you also get a USB, I gather, with all the software and stuff on it. On the screws. Oh, they're for mounts. Okay. Cool. Okay, so let's have a look at the, um, the unit. The unit has a connection for your printer. So your print, printer display cable going there. The USB-C cable would be for this cable. And then on the side you've got your attachments. One will be for the camera. And the other one will be for the USB. That's provided. To plug into. Okay, because it'll only do one additional device as well as your printer, yeah? Okay, so. That's what's included. Okay, guys, so. Uh, just a few things on it. It is a 1080p HD camera, so it's a 1080 by 920. Um, the screen on the unit is a 4.3 inch touch screen. Um, so what this allows you to do is to run clipper on your older sort of printers. So the ones that are sort of supported a, a lot of the Creality brands, but especially the Ender 3 one so your old Ender 3 um, the, the very original ones with the 32 bit boards it will run so it needs a 32 bit board on it so your old Ender 3, your Ender 3 Pros, your Ender 3 V2s your Ender 3 V2 Neo and your Ender 3 V3 SE if you want to upgrade it to Clipper so that's what you use one of these for um, the camera is not only just to use on these little nebula devices you can plug this directly into your if you've got a halite marge pro resin printer i have one connected directly into that and it runs up and sends the um, images to the creality cloud which you hop on with your phone and you can monitor it all with your phone um, so the camera you can buy separately it is 32.99 us the whole kit is 85 us okay so um, the beauty of it also is it provides wireless printing and when you've got the um, G adapter on it and the camera attached you can do spaghetti protection so it does AI spaghetti detection okay that's sort of the package as a whole so I hope that sort of gave you some sort of understanding of what you can buy so the reason to buy one of these over a sonic pad is if you only had one device if you've got more than one printer you want to connect up you go for the sonic pad which is the extended version of this that allows four devices so where the three printers one camera two cameras two printers that sort of thing um, if you liked any of the info or you want to keep up to date with what i'm doing please like and subscribe down below it does help the channel out and it is very much appreciated um, and i will see you next week when i'll do another video okay guys see you later bye Okay guys, thanks for watching. I really do appreciate the support. You might like one of these, or one of these videos um, that I've made in the past, so feel free. Okay, thanks guys, bye.